So Tom and Leah, this is your big night. After many months of planning and preparing, the time has finally come together with a lot of family and friends for us to celebrate the love that you share. Me and Tom, um, he's been one of my best friends for a long time. I think we met in kindergarten, we're probably about five years old at Kyiv, France. Um, we went on to be college roommates. We also worked on a pool together at Kehoe five or six years, and I think that's where um, you know the sparks started flying and butterflies started fluttering, and um, you know this this beautiful uh, relationship we're celebrating tonight um, began. So it was actually Leah's 17th birthday, and we went to Rocco's, all of us together, we went out, and um, it was just the night that confirms what we all were suspicious of, was, which was that Tom was in love with Leah. And he tried to hold her hand, and he bought her a drink, and it was very obvious that they were in love, and then nothing happened for four more years. <laughs> always known about Tom in high school Tom was always like oh yeah this summer Tom like who is this Tom boy he sounds fake <laughs> you're making him up okay sounds like you had a great summer fast forward four years later and we're sitting in the it might have been five I'm not sure but we're sitting in the lounge at Highland Elementary where Leah and I were teaching and we're having our lunch and she just looks at me and she says, I think I'm just gonna ask Tom to the wedding this weekend. And I was like, yes, come on, like this is what I've been waiting for. And uh, when she got home that night, our mother Judy asked her, how was the date? And I remember how excited Leah was and she said the night was perfect. She said, Tom opened up all my doors for me and even paid for all my drinks. As I was in the other room, I was eavesdropping and I thought, buying her drinks at a wedding? Clearly this guy's a smart guy, all right? I was actually with Leah the morning after the wedding. So she gets in the car and she's like, oh, hey guys. I'm like, what's going on? She's like, I had the best night. I'm like, well, tell me about it. She's like, well, I went to this wedding and I wasn't supposed to bring anyone, but I asked Tom. I was like, Tom, like high school fake Tom? That one? She's like, yeah, Tom. I was like, okay, how was? She's like, it was the best night of my life. He's gonna be my husband. You know, Tom, we're very proud of you and we love you very much and we knew that we loved Leah and she was perfect for Tom the first time we opened the door and we saw her beautiful warm smile and those big blue eyes and, also, and the way Tom was always so happy every time he was together with her. So. I, I really appreciate, welcome and love Tom. He's a great guy. I couldn't think of anybody better to marry Leah. And I'm so happy that he's taken Leah and her cat to live with them. He's now officially a part of your family, and there are no returns. So. Oh, hi. You look so you look beautiful. <laughs> he's going to love it. You look beautiful. Oh, 
Why? <laughs> Just cause? Yeah. Just yeah. Hey, Lee. <laughs> you look beautiful. <laughs> I'm so happy to see you. <laughs> I see. You like? Beautiful, Lee. It's beautiful. Wow. Is it what you pictured? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I couldn't keep my eyes off of you. Was it make believe? Or was it a dream? I've been waiting all my life. Feels like I. But one of my favorite memories was seeing firsthand how much Tom and Leah loved each other. Not sure if anyone has ever noticed, but they always give each other this little look and then they both start smiling and laughing and it's one of the cutest things I've ever seen. <laughs> All the years I've known Tom, I don't think I've, um, I've seen him happier than I have in the last couple of years. Leah, your love story is one that literally girls dream of. Like that boy that you had a crush on at your high school job waited for you for all these years. And Tom, I love how much you love Leah and thank you for patiently waiting for her. Now just watching them interact as a couple, I realized Tom must be really special. I couldn't have picked a better man for my little sister. I love you both and cheers to both of y'all, to Lee and Tom. Hi Thomas, take you Leah, to be my wife. Hi Leah, take you Thomas, to be my husband. To be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you, good times, good. in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and to honor you all the days of my life. The most important thing is that Tom and Leah continue to communicate honestly through good times and bad. May you have a long and happy life together, full of love, joy, and happiness.
now my privilege to introduce to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Thomas Bourgeois.